Bro, what the fuck is this dick hanging out of my forehead? Wait, like, what the fuck? Bro, I'm a, f I'm a fucking pretty little unicorn now. What the fuck? Batman. Big, the big B. <laughs> big B! What the Wolf Among Us? Man, I can't wait until that see that season two comes out. When season two of The Witcher comes out, it's gonna be mad. Oh, season two of The Wolf Among Us, not The Witcher. We're on season four now. What on a shitty shitty Witcher season? Uh, no. I may want to play this because I brought season two and haven't played it. I, I... Shadows? No, I'm not buying that shit. I'm not spending more money than I already have. Even though I got this for free. Yes. What I plan to do is I plan on doing a um one of these a week. Oh, even one a day would work. Or every time I'm on my doing a PlayStation stream. That would work. Uh, it's like bat tech I love. Forgot about that. I mean, you think purple does? Purple's cool. Yellow doesn't. Red's cool. But I think blue's like the classic look. Blue's that classic look. Classy. Classy from South Park. <laughs> With a little eye that hangs around. In fact, yeah. What is it? What, what did she say? I don't know. Plan I'm planning on doing a four hour stream tonight. Fuck I don't have my phone! My phone's not on my desk! Like Fuck! Fuck, I wanted to take a good photo. Well GG's I guess. I played this twice before. What are you <laughs> no fucking hesitation. <laughs> Super soldiers. That's right, Harvey Dent isn't Two Face yet. He's gonna show, bring the whole goddamn place down. Stay focused. We'll be out of here before anyone can stop us. I wanted to reconfigure my setup. Like, Mike. Imagine this. Mike, my monitor is like. Can't even tell. Like, my, the edge of my monitor is like right oh, here. You can. Right where my hand is. And that was like all the way over here. Where my arm is. My camera's like right at the edge, just so you can I can scent it. Gordon, it's Gordon. Gordon, if they're on the fifty-second floor, I'm going in. Hey, wait, wait for backup. Don't need it. Take the stairs. I heard stories. Is Gordon and Batman? I forgot. It's been been a while since I played this. Is Gordon and Batman working together? Hey, you ever seen him? Yeah, Gotham Zoo. With all the other flying animals. I, I, I would rather buy a place, uh, Xbox to stream off of. Hell yeah! I am him. Hmm. 
And he's like, ah, shit. <laughs> and then he sees this. <laughs> Troy Baker. It's the Troy man. It's it's it's, it's Bat Troy. It's Bat Baker. Bruce, you can't keep doing this. I have to. No one else will. It's one of the best Telltale -tell games they've done, in my opinion. Sacrificed. Next to Walking Dead. City is safe for now. Walking Dead. It's made you a target. Ooh, we could do that this stream. Rank all the Telltale -tell games. Until you're shot out of the sky. Uh, I can handle I it. Can handle I saw a thing with Troy Baker too recently that he was on an interview and they're talking about he's talking about his career about how when you get too good at voice acting and when and when everyone wants you in the game then obviously he says yes um people will stop people eventually stopped asking him to be in games because he's in pretty much everything which you shouldn't be as, as scared to do what's that Troy Baker is a fucking God, how he was acting. Him, Nolan North. <laughs> Catch a bitch! Meek! <laughs> Yo, this captured Batman perfectly. <laughs> Into the abyss he goes. <laughs> and there he goes. <laughs> they really think this was gonna work. This just makes it easier for him. <coughs> what the hell is this? <coughs> Batman. <laughs> Troy Baker's been in every Batman game then. That's like pretty much been out, because even besides Asylum. Besides the Arkham Asylum, I think he's... Yo, damn. I know you're trying to create a myth, but be careful you don't turn into a monster. No, he's trying to make Sometimes a legend. You need a monster. Come on! Come on! <laughs> <laughs> uh. Bring it! You're done, mate. So brutal. <laughs> Didn't your mother teach you to knock? Sit on me. I'm sorry. Behind you, big boy. <laughs> oh shit! I thought you were talking to me. I wonder why she called me Big Boy. Oh, how do you know? I'm slightly below average. You're succeeding. Criminals are becoming afraid of you, so are the police. Down! It's a scare tactic, Al. Just a performance. I don't think it's a scare tactic. Well, I mean, it kind of is. Beating people to death is... Not a scratch. So far. It kind of is a scare tactic. 
That doesn't belong to you. I was wondering if we'd cross paths. You broke the law. Here I am. <laughs> Cut the shit. The law. Don't tell me that's why Yo, I do all of this. I would not mind. Squeeze into a suit. Tie on a cape. I'd do it for the thrill. Uh, they say Neath protecting. Needs a hero. Someone to hunt down people like you. So that makes me what? A villain? Sounds fun. Gotta admit it though. You give a good chase. One day you might actually catch me. Tonight. Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. They never corner That's a fat man too. Cage. Bring it, bat. Okay. <laughs> Bro, I mean, if I was Batman, I would just do. I would stand there and take it. I would just let it sit on me. Reckon Catwoman into that shit? Uh oh. Oh yes, yes, sit on me. Bro, you just punched a girl. GG's. One, one alpha male. One absolute alpha. Ugh. What if she was pregnant? <laughs> Jokes on you! I like that shit! I'm not the bad guy here. Where did the other one be Batman? Trouble for this. Yeah. Shit. A myth can't be killed. You, however, are flesh and blood. Uh, a myth can be killed. Yo, who the fuck just shot me? Damn it! I said don't shoot me. No, wait. Man knew it wasn't going to work. Man just had a. Dr I feel like Andrew. I feel like Andrew Garfield right now. What do we just let her default? Let her die. It would be like GG's, I guess. What the fuck happened to my Pepsi? Oh, that's right here. Uh, I've seen your face. I was wrong about you catching me. Not sure if it was for my sake or yours. Don't struggle or you'll fall. Oh, but that's what you crave the struggle. I know men like you. Hey, what a bitch! I saved her life. Right, she stole the thing though. That's why she uh Oh no no she stole my back claw. Step out of the shadows and be Bruce Wayne tonight. 
Oh, that's a much uh, harder fight. Oh my god, my fucking... Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Well then. Whoa! That pixelation! That was insane. Oh my god. That is insane pixelation right there, my guys. That was mental. Absolutely crazy. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. A humble district attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. Even one who cut Gotham's crime rate in half. For too long, this city has burned with corruption. His voice sounds familiar. Under Mayor Hill's authority. But I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. Together, we can stamp out the fire and save our great city. If only Mr. Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, could have heard that applause, he would sh Well, there he is. Fashionable and fashionably late, as always. Say hi, Bruce. Hi, Bruce. <laughs> oh my god, is that actually what it is? Hi, Bruce. I tee him up and he knocks him down. That's how Mr. Wayne and I do business. Thank you. Thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering support. Together, we will change God. Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Now, I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner everyone will leave you alone. Relax, it was important. Not more than this. I know you despise these things, and truth be told, I do too. What, a chance to show off your teeth and talk about yourself to a room full of money? Say it ain't so. It's called playing the game, Bruce. <laughs> the game's the game. I noticed I'm playing for City Hall. No one came here tonight to see me. To see the Bruce Wayne, am I right? <laughs> and I can see him just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little FaceTime with potential. Ew, have has anyone ever had a kidney stone? Let's be real here. A mouth that's saying, support Harvey Dent. We're the grease, they're the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham a place for families again. I'll do anything for Gotham. It's my home. It's our home. This will help you too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. Now all I need is a decent slogan. I'm terrible at those. Put a dent in crime? Like used car salesman. All right, all right. How about, uh, put a dent in crime? Hmm? Look at you. It's not half bad. I'm gonna use that. Bruce, I meant what I said. Together, you and me, we change Gotham. No, Bruce, you need to copyright that. Where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey. But you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, you can start with a few hands. Hmm? Come on. Isn't that maybe Oswald? Yeah, cool. Mr. Wayne, I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. After all, whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone we like can all make a to difference. lead this city to greatness. Well, thank you. But we're all here tonight because we want to make a difference. And that's what it's going to take. Every single one of us. Not just me. I don't want to be the shitty uh, man. rich man. Everyone. Right, right. Of course. Old families like ours should flock together, you know. Like birds. You're preaching, dear. No, it's true. The Waynes and Zellerbachs are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. This city's luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall. 
That Cape Bat Freak dealing out vigilante justice like a <coughs> goddamn West. Oh, Bobby, regarding Golden Age, seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for. I being don't think blood. being in your 90s One is your Golden Age, you dumb so. fuck. And it's a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. Harvey Dent can. Harvey Dent is our best shot. Put him in a room with anyone for 15 minutes, and that grin will win him over. He's gonna need more than that, son. Well, it hasn't been 15 minutes yet, Bob. You've still got time. <laughs> hey, don't worry, though. I am not doing this alone. With Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. It will be dedicated to Thomas and Martha Way in the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents did for this city, to be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway, it was terrible. Truly terrible. Uh, a tragedy like that at such a young age it must have been crippling. If only that deranged man had gotten the right Thanks for your sympathy. Maybe, uh, well, I don't like to think about maybe. Oh, wait, no, Harvey might get angry at that. But Oh, oh well. Well, thank you. I wish my parents could be here speaking with you too. And thank you, Bruce, for investing in the health of this city's future. You have our support, Mr. Dent. Go get him. We're on our way. <laughs> Not saying I doubted you, but that went better than expected. It is a night of ringing endorsements. Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicky Vale. Not sit on my face, Vicky. Vicky, sit on it. This is a private fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? No, get the fuck out of my house. Me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. Actually, uh, I do mind, Mr. actually. Wayne. Actually, I do mind. If you're not on the list, you're not here. Sorry. <sighs> we'll talk tomorrow, then. Mr. Wayne, you've, you've got something on your collar. Uh, uh, is that blood? Yeah. It looks like... Cut myself oh, shaving. This? No, it's nothing. It's just, uh... Cut myself shaving. What? Your butler didn't help you this time? Hey, kidding. Kidding. Hey, okay, Harvey. It was just a joke. It was a joke. Another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. Falcone. Oh shit. Carmine Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, Miss Vale. Yeah, no, shut the fuck up, Vicky. Before I shut it for you. And what kind of business do you think he's in? With my massive swarm! Enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham for all of us. Okay. But at least hear him out before you kick him out. I'm trusting Harvey. I like this, Harv, but I'm trusting you. Thank you, Bruce. Seriously, you know I have to pull every string I can to get elected. Yeah, well, I'll just make sure this one doesn't hang you. Word of warning, Bruce. He hates you. <laughs> Play nice. Yo, imagine getting crushed yeah, in between Harley Dent's thighs. Like, oh, Decent like, walk, oh, I can't breathe. Seals, plenty of room <clears throat> for my cars. I think I'll take it. You're that Victor Sullivan? Though the decor offends my eyes. <laughs> Man, Let's talk fresh, privately. No class. Let's talk privately, shall we? <laughs> I like this guy. Yeah, it is Sully from really Uncharted. Business before we even introduce ourselves. But we'll get to that. Come on, Falcone. Thank you for welcoming me into your home. Oh, fuck. Everyone's going to be like, oh, shit. You're a respectable man. Oh, fuck it. Shake his hand. It's Bruce Wayne. I know who you are. The guy is going to sell me his house. 
That's probably the biggest mistake I could have made. I shouldn't have shook his hand. But it's Victor Sullivan. His voice is just so sexy. You should know, Mr. Falcone. My analysts say we're raising triple with Mayor Hill. Boy, Harvey can come in. You'll be fine out there, Harvey. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a few minutes. Oh, no, Harvey comes Harvey with me. stays with us. A man's home is his castle. I respect that. Seen and not heard. Whatever you... <laughs> what did I say? Shut the fuck up, Falcone! I will fucking shoot you! Mr. I will whip out my giant strong! To make sure the rules Yo, Falcone, I will sh whip out my below average long and slap you with it. Right. You understand? And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just say anywhere. Harvey will make off Unlike better. most people I've met, Harvey actually has integrity. He's trying to make Gotham a better place. So am I. So will you. Hey, we all carry this city on our broken backs. Might lighten the load if we do so together. I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. So, let's talk relationships. Okay. Okay. Chalk this for me. Be a pal. I can get Harvey the mayor's seat. Or I can pull it out from under him. Okay. I'll play nice. This is me. And these are all my friends in Gotham. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. Why does it keep doing that? That's why I came tonight to your lovely home, hoping to make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light, if need be. I'm just doing this for Harvey. In mind, I bet we employ half the city. Look, I'm only talking to you because Harvey asked, trusting a friend to know what's best for Gotham. Now that's a predicament. You listen to me, kid. I know somewhere inside that tuxedo you understand this situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew which hands to shake. Which to break. Whatever you say. Whatever you say. You're a good kid. You look like him, you know? Fat the mustache. We understand each other. Master Bruce, your guests are leaving. I recommend seeing them out. You wouldn't want to be rude. Hey, I appreciate the hospitality, Mr. Wayne. But I, uh... Is that solely for my charter? I'll put an offer on the house. A nice guy like you should have a nice place to live. Oh, thanks, Falcone. Seeing you, Falcone. Bro, wow, I still got a little penis on my forehead now. Ew. I look like an anime character with this little strain of hair. What the fuck? I'm him now. Jump scare. <laughs> Let's look it up, shall we? It's me. Harvey Dent. A string of home and 
invasions rippled through the city's already crime-infested East End. Apparently, the bandits are using stolen GCPD battery rams to force their way in, with breaking and entry incidents up 4% over last year. Remember to keep those front doors locked tonight. And we have breaking news tonight. Five criminals are in custody this evening after a break-in at City Hall. But thanks to the efforts of the Batman, the stolen items were returned. Not all of them. Let's see what she was really after. But before we get thought, Travis Willingham plays. Plays Harvey Dent. No idea who that motherfucker is, though. Let's look him up. Wait, Selena Kyle or Catwoman's Laura Bailey? Yo, someone's getting the jaw in one. Yeah, Rich, yeah, Richard McGonagall. Is he not Sully? Yeah, he's Sully. Yeah. What about what about uh the guy who plays Harvey Dent? Um, he's in a lot of shows. But I swear I've heard his voice. I swear I've heard the guy who plays Harvey Dent somewhere. Yo, yo, we play. He, pl he plays Ken and Bolt and Ben Ten. Yo, no, I swear. If I Jar to Power from a Star Wars, I think that's what it is. Yeah. Yo, we plays. He plays Ace from One Piece. Hey, yo! Alright. We got Ace from One Piece. Yeah, I, I, I already know. Wait, does it say their age? How old they are? Nah. I like it when a game does that, it tells you how old the characters are. That way you don't get caught in 4K. Yo, look at Vicky Vale. Yo. I would, I would let Vicky Vale have her way with me. Really fell off a building for this. Vicky Vale could absolutely. I would let her peg me. Hell, I, I'd let a lot of people peg me for the right price. For the right price. The price is right. What can I insert the thing? Oh, here it is. Uh, oh wait, how, how, the, how the fuck do you scroll? He's 26! Damn! Yo, he, he used the thing that I told him. Uh, wait, is it this? Here we go. You might as well just leave the chair up all the time. It's too it's too slow. Encrypted. Then hack it. You have the world's Wait, best man, computer in front of you. Kitchen, the library, gymnasium, the he's got like 20 he's running like 2080p. 
And yet I always find you here, in a dark, damp cave, in front of a computer. I like this cave. I'm more at home here than the rest of the house, you know. Then we should build an eighth bedroom down here. Sure, Can we? The headlines now. Bruce Wayne, billionaire, entrepreneur, king. Quite an eclectic resume. Did Cave you find dwell. out what that um, cat woman tried to steal? Well, in the process. No, just call her pussy cat. Let me try a different angle. Rotate hologram. I bet. Uh, what am I even looking for? This is a map of the oh, there we go. shoreline. Shoreline, uncharted oh, reference, uh, uncharted uh, reference. Money, weapons, drugs, everything flows through that port. Maybe it's where Mayor Hill picks up his dry cleaning. Hmm. Can't make sense of it yet. There's still plenty of files to decrypt. And in the meantime, I saved you what I could. Thanks, Al. Yeah, the same you saved me what you could. I see a empty cup with a bowl full of sugar. Falc is it? Is that actually how it's pronounced? I thought it was just Falcone. I'd recommend leaving the fist fights to your alter ego. Bloodstains are much harder to remove from a tuxedo. Yeah, thanks for the interruption. <laughs> well, it wasn't for you, Bruce. I was worried I might drink all my good scotch. For the record, your, your scotch father despised men like Falcone. Thought they ruined Gotham's my Sarah scotch, reputation. Alfred. Mine. Back when it still had one. It can again. I be. own you, Alfred. You're my butler. Though people like this, well, I pay you. Helping. Is she new to town? Seen her before. Hopefully, she's just a tourist. No, nope, she lives I'll here. The codex. She lives here. <sighs> GG's. I've missed. Founder. New criminal on the scene. Try tied to several recent break-ins. She's effective and doesn't leave many clues behind. Currently, GCPD has no leads. Wish I knew more about her. Not much to find, apparently. A few burglaries, break-ins. Seems to lay pretty low. You could learn a thing or two from her. What the you fuck, can't Alfred? Outside without it ending up in the news lately, as Bruce or Batman. I stay out of sight when I need to. Define need to. Well, whenever Harvey calls, the guy's exhausting. Well, after the press conference tomorrow, I'll mark your calendar as exhausted. Then the media isn't good for anyone's health. Now, I don't mean to beat a dead argument, but no one's gonna figure it out now. Trust me. Miss Vale noticed your injuries, so did Mr. Dent. If they put it together with the incident at the mayor's office, it would undo all the long nights and close calls we've endured to get here. You're in the spotlight more than ever. Yeah, you're right, Alfred. You're right, you're right. I should have cancelled the event. But I know how much pressure you're under. I don't mean to add to it. It's okay, right? Alfred, you're like my dad. Really Alfred's like my if daddy. If you a suit that fits me, we can trade places some night. Though I'm not partial to heights. Uh, men worry. You know what I liked about the Gotham show? One more worry for the list. Was that... Not only was it a good origin story for Batman, for Bruce Wayne. I thought I saw... But... What? Alfred was the one that taught Bruce out of it, which I like. Indeed, you two were thick as thieves. Oswald, however, took that role more literally than you. Dishonorable discharge, illegal boxing matches, arms dealing, prison stints. 
That's a criminal grand slam, if I'm using the expression correctly. Unfortunately, you are. Oswald claimed he only wanted to catch up, but his behavior following his family's collapse is troubling. Why he's returning now, I haven't the faintest idea. He needs money. You think he's looking for a handout? He would have come to the right person. No, because I'm... Because you're generous. A little too much sometimes, with your wealth, your time, and even your well-being. Even though you and young Master Cobblepot used to be close, I'd advise you to be cautious. Yeah, you're right, you Alfred. You're all right. You're right. But I'll be careful, Alfred. When you see what's become of this park, I think you will. I'm Batman. I'm just too good. Too good. Yeah, all the homeless people will be like, why the fuck is Bruce Wayne walking around? No bodyguards in like the in a dump. Truth is, I'm here to see a uh, a penguin. I'd give him a change. Uh, thank you, sir. I'm a generous guy. <laughs> Great. It was a setup. Is the statue was it a setup? I can't remember. No eyes. My hook dude just appeared. Oh no, he's over there now. I'm just gonna stay out of sight from him, honestly. Stay away from the dude. Hey, any course he walks over. Watch wallet cash. Like this goes through you. You think I'm scared of a knife? Hey, you heard it, man. Try and take the hell it. Are you waiting for? Go ahead. Try and take it. The hell you say? And him. Gentlemen! Oz. Keep walking, all right? This don't concern you, twerp! You see, that's where you're mistaken. My old mate and I have some catching up to do. And you're uh. in the moment! Come here! I think that'll do! What a, what a lad. Stay down! <laughs> what an idiot. Oh, oh, whoa. This is my park. Mine. You hear that? <laughs> oh, hey, Bruce. You've got a little, uh. Yeah, good as new. What about you? Woo, that was the right little scrap, eh? Nothing kickstarts the system like a dash of adrenaline. Thanks for the, uh, be nice for it now. <laughs> Thanks for the backup. I yanked you away from your bloody ivory tower, Bruce. Least I can do is make sure you don't get shaped. Oh, that's very thoughtful of you. Yeah, it's been what? Two decades. And you know what? I haven't been mugged once that entire time. <laughs> uh, that wasn't why I brought you here, mate. Right now. I am trying to recognize the little Bruce I used to run around this place with. Back when it wasn't, you know, like this. This park used to mean something. A place that was safe for kids, for families. People came from all over to visit. All right. Well, those were better days. That they were. Yeah. Thought we'd grow up to be kings, I did. Both of us. <sighs> this city. Choose right through people. <sighs> Mum committed to Arkham. Dad ended it yourself, you did. 
a family's fortune. It's nothing left, please. I know. Alfred told me. Uh, it's funny, huh? Same place that ground my family to dust. Gave you the good life. Used to run in the same circles we did. Hobnobbing parties, round the world. I lost my parents too. Potential. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, guys. No one should have to go through that. Thanks, Bruce. But we are not the only ones suffering. Here's an you haven't seen, Bruce. You still care about something more than just yourself. Although, I was surprised to see Carmine Balcone at your party last night. Made himself right at home. That oily. <sighs> Wish I could have punched that grin into the back of his throat. He wasn't invited. Falcone was an uninvited guest. That's it. Never want to see his face again. On that, we can agree in earnest. Falcone made a stack of cash and corpses a mile high, ruining families like mine. All he needs is a little push. And... Whoa, this guy just they teleported. He just spawned in. His trench coat just spawned. Sorry, mate. This reunion got a lot more grim than I planned. Things are going to be on the upswing soon, though. A revolution is knocking on Gotham's door. And I'm here to let it in. Which brings me to you, Bruce. You see, you throw a rock in any direction, you break a window that Wayne Enterprises owns. As the rich and powerful go. Oh, you top Gotham's list. When my revolution starts, we're going to smash windows and cross off names all the way down. Like I said, it's not going to be pretty. I'm not your enemy. It's going to be beautiful. I'm, I'm not, not your enemy. Enemy, Forrest. That remains to be seen, don't it? I've got great affection for you, Bruce. I really do. Which is why I'm warning you. When this whole thing starts, Make sure you're on the right side. I'll be on the side of justice. Justice. Good seeing you, Bruce, but I got some rocks to collect. Cheers. I don't trust this motherfucker. Press conference for a new hospital style singing car waiting on South. South Park! <gasps> South Park reference in Batman! Did that kind of look like a thing would do? Yeah! Yeah! Damn! Wayne Meta be massive. Oh, that's Alchemist Island, didn't I? Mr. Wayne, over here! Right here! This way. Bruce, Bruce. Oh, okay, okay. Pretty sure you have enough photos, guys. Of Bruce Wayne? Never. <laughs> Morning, Mr. Dent. Hey, Bruce, you mind if we swap cars? I mean, mine isn't fast and the paint's rusting off, but boy, does she have charm. <laughs> We didn't bring you all out here to discuss cars, honestly. We're here about Arkham Asylum. Ever since it opened its doors, Arkham has been a breeding ground for the criminally insane. Its methods for rehabilitation, crude. Its security, lacking. And the rate of death and suicide inside the asylum itself is truly terrifying. <clears throat> but today, with a sizable contribution from this man here, we break ground on a state-of-the-art mental health care facility. One that will improve the well-being of Gotham and its citizens for years to come. And Mr. Wayne has a few words he'd like to say. Bruce? For those with mental health issues, there are no cuts or scrapes. Their ailments are often invisible. But sure. inside, yeah. 
their supper. You know, when I was uh, nine years old, my parents took me to see a movie about a hero in a mask. It was a hero who stood up to oppression and defended the people from injustice, no matter the cost. That night, my parents paid the ultimate cost defending me from a man who needed the kind of help this new facility will provide. Let's put a dent in crime. This facility. Yeah, let's use it. Let's use the new catchphrase. Mayor, we can put a dent in crime. Today, on the anniversary of that fateful night, we dedicate this facility to Thomas and Martha Wayne and usher in a new era of healing for Gotham. I'm uh, sure you all have plenty of questions about the new hospital, so let's open it up. You first, Miss Vale. Thank you. With the opening of Sit this on me. new hospital, what does this mean for Arkham Asylum? What happens to the old building? Tear it down. We should tear down the walls and erase it from the map. I don't want us lingering on past mistakes. I want us to focus on Gotham's future. We Harvey have loves that. Uh, you there. Mr. Wayne, Julia Remark of the Tribune. My sources say Damn, Gotham's she's not bad either. Boss, Carmine Falcone into your home. Uh oh. You even shook his hand. With Harvey's guest. Harvey is the one who invited him. Personally, I would never welcome that man into my house. Oh, fuck. I shouldn't have done that. Anyone else have a question? Oh, fuck. Please keep your questions on topic, people. We're here about the hospital, remember? Ignore. <laughs> Sorry, Alfred. Uh, this, way, this morning, the Globe received evidence of an offshore bank account managed by Carmine Falcone and your father, Thomas Wayne. What exactly are you implying? Transactions connected to organized crime going back years and continuing to this day. The paper trail ties your family directly to the mob. Care to comment? How dare you? No comment. I don't comment on rumors. Why don't we just stick to real journalism here? Mr. Wayne, Mr. Wayne, is all your money dirty? Is the Wayne family legacy built on lies? Did you know about this, Bruce? How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? What are you telling us? Does the mob sign Wayne Enterprises' This interview is over. All right, this press conference is over. Mr. Wayne, Mr. Wayne, how long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? Did you know about this, Bruce? What are you telling us? I'm sorry about this, Bruce. Where the hell it's coming from? Damage controls my territory. We'll talk later. Everyone, everyone, please settle down. I'll be fielding your questions from here on out. Please, let's try to keep this civilized. Bruce, I've been trying to reach you. The police are inside the manor. Oh, shit, that's right. I forgot the police are investigating. Because... But don't they start taking everything? Yeah. Hey, hey, careful! Put it back. I'm afraid we can't, Mr. Wayne. Says who? This warrant. It's not personal. I had the boys turn the lights off, keep a low profile. I understand. You're just doing your job. Trying to? It's hard to be a cop in this city. Every battle's uphill in the rain with skates on. Alfred, keep an eye on them. Make sure they only take what they have to. Of course, sir. I meant what I said about not personal. We only want files related to Wayne Enterprises. The warrant covers your place, pardon me, places of residence, and any companies you own. Your holdings are extensive. And what do you expect to find? That's for our analysts back at the precinct to figure out. I can't comment. It's a valid warrant. I gotta serve. Mayor Hill signed off on this himself. That's right. As long as he's mayor, he calls the shots. 
The DA is going to hear about this. Uh, unless Harvey becomes a mayor, there's not much he can do. Can't smile this thing to death. I don't know how your neck ended up on Mayor Hill's shopping block, but here we are. It's because Hill I'm supporting Harvey. Go down, Harvey's campaign goes down too. That'd be a real shame. Mr. Dent's the only DA I ever trusted to make a conviction stick. As mayor, I think he can finally turn things around for us. For all our sakes, I pray you've got nothing to hide. I, I don't. Could my parents never told me that they dealt with fucking the mob. And GG, you just broke my fucking family photo. I'm going to sue your ass for everything you own. That's a bad omen. <laughs> GG's, I guess. Duh. Damn. That came from the core. Oh, here comes the PTSD. Take whatever you want. Just don't hurt my boy. I have to do this. Get the Bruce. fuck out, Vicky. You're again. You're uninvited. I didn't mean to interrupt, but you keep showing up in uninvited. This is the second time you've shown up uninvited. Well, it's difficult to book a meeting with you. Well, I enjoy my privacy. Enjoyed. Past tense. Sorry, but if the press has their way, you're not gonna have any for a while. <sighs> Listen, Bruce, a scandal surrounding a beloved family like yours captures the public's attention. I can help you get the right kind of attention. Through my connections at the Gazette, I have all kinds of access. What's your aunt? I can dig up whatever what? you need to fight this. I appreciate the offer, Miss Vale, but trying to say I'm the good guy here... Instantly makes you look bad. I get it. So let me say it for you. The Gazette received this supposed evidence like every other media outlet. And it's all hearsay. Flimsy sources. There isn't a shred of hard proof. Still, allegations like this, they, they don't magically appear. Someone is going after my family. After me. Obviously, the sender didn't identify themselves. It's not, off, it's not Falcone, it's uh, Oswald. No idea who it could be. The Penguin. I mean, no one's even done their due diligence on this yet. The press saw the fumble, they grabbed the ball, and ran. Not every day you get to go out. He's politically life. motivated. Hill wants me out of the picture because with my backing, Harvey wins in a landslide. All signs point to Hill. <sighs> You're a kingmaker, Mr. Wayne. And Harvey Dent is Gotham's knight in shining armor just waiting for the crown. You're the first target on Hill's list. Next will be Harvey. By tonight, this scandal will be broadcast to every screen in Gotham. Everyone will be talking about it. This isn't my first pass through the rumor mill. I know the damage it can do. Then go on the record. Right here, right now, and stop it. You need to get out ahead of this. Your side is what matters, not wild speculation. Fine, I give a quiet the record then. Whenever you're ready. Um My family is innocent story. Justice will be served. Whoever fabricated these lies about my family. They will get what they deserve. Understood. That's exactly what the people of Gotham need to hear. Wait, I just remembered Vicky's the bad guy. No! Ah, if you fucked up! You're gonna beat this, Bruce. The Waynes always come out on top. Goodbye, Miss Vale. I just come in general. <laughs> I can't keep a straight face when I say stuff like that. I'm so immature. I to admit it, but everyone smells smoke. A fire is heading this way. <laughs> nah, I smell amazing. Nothing not like smoke. Support Gotham, even in its darkest days. All this on the anniversary of your parents. Not a coincidence. Harvey's the district attorney. He should have told me this was coming. Then find out why he didn't. Because he could have didn't go through Harvey. 
Hey, if you walk in the angle. A warrant? What the hell's going on? Wait, does this have to do with what the reporters were talking about this morning? Someone's yeah, after me. someone's coming after me. Let's avoid making another scene, shall we? The press is already up my ass as it is. I'm sorry, Hoppy. Mayor Hill authorized this? Yeah, then the cops raid my house, taking everything related to Wayne Enterprises. Computers, hard drives, files. Oh, son of a bitch. You're the goddamn DA, Harvey. I didn't know about this. I swear. I believe him. Hill totally I believe him. He me on this one. God damn it. Okay, I, I believe you, Harvey. Mayor Hill's trying to screw us both over with this move. And then he's made two enemies. I just don't get it. Why would Hill stick his neck out over this? Just to tangle you up in some frivolous investigation? It just doesn't make sense. I mean, what could he possibly hope to accomplish other than a few cheap headlines? He can't be, it's not fucking. It's gotta be politically motivated. Hill can't match your fundraising, so he's trying to take out your biggest donor. I don't know. This is a new low, even for Hill. Ah, oh, God, what a mess. Bruce, I wish I could just make this go away, but I'm not sure if I can. If I get in the way of this investigation, Hill would be able to spin it as a conflict of interest. And that wouldn't be good for either of us. It would jeopardize the entire campaign. Just keep your distance. You should probably distance yourself from me. What? No, no, I can't do that. Well, you may have to. Don't say that. You- There you are. Hey, you? Sorry, I got a habit of being late. No, no, just glad you made it. Ah! Uh. You didn't tell me you were bringing a friend to dinner. This is Selena. I hope I'm not interrupting anything. I have Just election nonsense. Oh, he hasn't mentioned Harvey you. Never mentioned you before. Oh, really? That's interesting. What was your name again? Uh, it's Selena. Selena Kyle. It's a strong grip you've got there. Go what on. could I say? I'm. I'm not gonna fall. Kind of a professional. Oh, sorry. Selena's new to town. I've been showing her around mm -hmm. Gotham, introducing her to people. You're an excellent tour guide, Harv. Well, if I lose the election, I guess I can drive one of those double-decker tour buses around town. How'd you get that shiner? Bruce? That's okay. I'm Might sorry, I'm sorry. I have to have to know. I was mugged. I'm just angry I let that masked freak get away with all my stuff. I still can't believe I let you walk home alone. I should have called you a car. Did you lose? Well, I sure hope whatever he took wasn't too valuable. Actually, it was. It's probably long gone by now. Whatever that idiot took. I hope not. These were important materials. Ooh. Sensitive? Very. I don't know how I'm gonna explain this to my client. When things like this happen in my line of work, people tend to overreact. We should just be thankful you got away with a black eye. Oh, understand. I'm sure your clients will understand. I doubt it. In my business, people aren't very forgiving. At least I'm not the only one who's taken a beating. That press conference? Oof. We've got it under control. Do you? I'll handle it. Someone at my office has to know what's going on. Uh, excuse me a moment. Hey, it's Harvey. So tell me! You're the hot woman, right? Like, so, tell me, you're cat woman, right? It's you! I give you that black eye! But that sounds so wrong. Man, the unspoken... R the sexual tension is high. I can smell it. Uh, likewise. Likewise. This explains a lot, actually. How you can afford the fancy armor, the toys. Wouldn't Harvey be surprised? <laughs> Not to mention, everyone in this cafe. Sorry about the black eye. 
That's not the first time a man's hit me. Sorry to hear that. Don't worry. I'm not gonna expose you. Yet. I'm curious about something now. I do what I do for money, but you're Bruce Wayne. <laughs> I'm doing Seriously, it. Wait. Bruce, you guys are getting paid? I have to. But you. I have my reasons. I take the risk. I think you know enough already. The rest is my secret. And here I was thinking we were starting to get somewhere. How disappointing. You have something that belongs to me. Oi! 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 It's awkward for me. I'm used to robbing people. Not the you have something of mine. As I recall, you took something from me too. Hope you're getting some use out of that grappling gun. I'm more interested in how I can use you. These people I'm working for, they don't screw around. If I fail to deliver that drive, it's going to cost a lot more than money. Well, looks like you've made your bed. No, we've made this bed. And I'm not gonna lie in it alone. You owe me. If they don't get what they uh -oh. want, there will be consequences. I don't like consequences. I can... All right. If you want my help, you got it. What can I do? You can give me back uh. the drive. <laughs> not possible. Listen, I don't have a lot of time. My employer is expecting me to drop it off. Where? Just give it back. The address. Now. No. Give me the drive. Selena, please give me the address. Oh, he says please when he wants to. Okay, Bruce. Seeing as I'm screwed either way. My contact. He'll be expecting a cat. Not a bat. When are you supposed to meet him? Fifteen minutes ago. Better hurry. Everything okay <clears> here? <throat> yeah, I just took our number. You tell me. I have my people working on it. We're gonna straighten everything out. I feel better already. Sorry, but I've gotta run. So soon? Aren't you gonna stay for a drink? Yeah, Bruce. Stay for a drink? <laughs> I'd love to, but I've got another appointment and I really don't want to be late for it. Oh, all right then. Don't forget to change into your suit. What's wrong with the one I'm wearing? This picture's being insane! She's gonna reveal my identity! She's gonna reveal my identity as Batman if she's not careful. If she's not careful, Salim's gonna get the uh Alfred, I'm at the warehouse. She's gonna get one of those. She's gonna get the super slap, like Vicky got. It's quiet. She's gonna get the uh sound of an ambush. Stay on guard. I'll take it back. Do one of these ones then. Batman have does Batman not have aura? Oh shit. Massacre. Mm. Mm. This wasn't a hand. Mm. It was a massacre. How many? He just said he just copied me now. I I I could I just killed I, 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 uh, Oh good lord. Yeah. Who could have done such a thing? That's what I'm gonna find. I was Lord Cobblepot. Gordon, East Side Docks, Warehouse 133. Oh, are those intestines? Yeah. Nasty. Analyzing. That's pretty cool. He's got he's got a, he's, <laughs> he's like um what is it, Professor or Doctor Light from Teen Titans? He's like Starlight from the boys. He just go have the computer catalog the compound for further analysis. As you wish. Um Nothing left to bury. Yeah, man, man imploded himself. Uh, is there anything else I can scan? No. Okay, I gotta link this to this. There's a connection. Whatever exploded did so with enough force to obliterate the person standing next to it. 
but the chemicals themselves were inert, not explosive. Well, it appears to have made a pretty big boom. I'll see what I can piece back together. Um, I gotta examine. I've seen these outfits before. Same mercs that broke into City Hall. Yeah, the one that I, uh, I, whoa, hey, don't look at me like that, buddy. The canister exploded, sending shrapnel right through the container door. For once, I'm glad you arrived after the heist. Your armor wouldn't have protected you against that. I'll open it. Button smashing? Nope. I forgot how jacked Batman is, honestly. Looks like a bullet started this. A normal bullet couldn't have caused that explosion. But a this carbine. The point of entry is melted. So I can link that to something. Um. Canisters were stored here. Canisters of what? Um, what do you fucking think? Explosives? Hell, I'm not even a detective and I know that. It's a cop. The force grows thinner every day. <laughs> These are not the cops you were looking for. Um. Here we go. Something was here when the explosion occurred. Uh, unscorched area. Could I... Could I link... Anything? Oh, I know there's stuff over here. White Rose. Falcone's calling card. He's been busy as of late. Send the drones hunting. I want to know his every move. But uh, it wasn't it a setup for Falcone? It was actually um, it was. It, I know it's Vicky and Cobblepot that. Vicky or Cobblepot. No. It's one of them. Oh damn! Man got turned into Nick Fury. Face slashed, throat torn open. So not natural causes then. And then they set up. Catwoman. Skylight Club. Falcone. This man's been badly burned. The damage seems to originate from inside his skull. What did this? Yeah. That's a useful tool. Sensors say it's an incendiary round. Phosphorus residue. Incendiary round. This could have superheated the content. Man's playing Call of Duty. Call of Duty in Gotham. <laughs> Wouldn't that be a cool map? Broken nails, bits of human flesh. He's the one who clawed the uh the face. Uh, the f bloody hands. That. The cop shredded this murk to pieces, barehanded. God, what would cause someone to do that? The nerve agent could make them psychotic. Fear toxin. The incendiary incendiary bullet. Um. It could have been. Well, no, it, that would be connected to this, would it not. Fire. 
find a connection. The bullet that killed the cop is the same type that blew up the canister. Well, I'm sure they didn't find that at a local gun store. It appears military. Uh oh. I mean, this would have to be connected to the face. Huh? Huh? Something I'm missing then. There's one thing I'm missing. I am missing something and I don't know what. Oh yeah, we're gonna be here all night. All night. Um. Wait, here we go. Yeah, no, we gotta. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. We're not going to be here all night now. Someone drove off after the explosion. Have you put it together? Yes. It's like Arkham. Arkham City. Arkham Knight. Oh, even Asylum has cops. some stuff like Stolen this. Stolen chemicals. He's making a big move. One of his snipers hit a canister with an incendiary bullet, causing it to superheat and explode. This may have been a distraction or a way of destroying evidence. Cops moved in to stop the theft. Falcone's men got them down. Then things turned grim. Possibly due to the psychoactive nerve agent. A cop ripped up a merc's face with his bare hands. It was put down. Same sniper, same type of bullet. Looks like Falcone's men got what they wanted and escaped. Have you located the shooter? No, but based on two impact trajectories, the canister and the dead cop, the shooter could only have a clear shot from there, there, or there. And would have contaminated himself with the phosphorus residue. Program the skimmers to pick up that signature. Right away, sir. Right away, sir. I'm gonna say I'm pretty sure he was here. Both targets could have been shot from here. No phosphorus trace. This is a pretty good sniper spot. Sniping nest. Sniper's nest right here. Yeah, there we go. Phosphorus spike. Clear vantage point. We have a winner. Trace stops here. Then he should be nearby. Found him. Time to go to work. Wait, isn't he dead? <laughs> no, he's not dead. My turn. <laughs> Where are they? Don't make me add your corpse to this graveyard. Balcone, why did he do this? I, I ain't telling you nothing. You, you can't make me talk. You didn't do this alone. Where are the others? Long gone. You won't find him! 
You trying to scare a confession out of me? I won't break. Your bones will. <laughs> Batman, Batman, the, Troy Baker is going to give this guy the Joel in one. Give me a reason. Give me a reason to stop. You know, you can bleed to death without ever spilling a drop. All on the inside. Tell me the plan, or I start swinging. I. Tell me. That cab woman was supposed to hand over a drive. Had the container number we needed, but she flaked. So we had to find it ourselves. Uh, container by container. Uh, someone must have heard us. Called the cops. We were told no witnesses. Why risk open war with the GCPD? Some kind of chemicals. <laughs> Falcone wanted them. What are the chemicals for? We were paid to steal them, not ask questions. <laughs> Please don't. No. I start here and keep breaking until you answer. The chemicals, there's some kind of explosive. Bro, a weapon. This Batman knows what to do. Tony said he'd use them soon. Used where? That's all I know. I swear, I swear. I told you everything I know. <laughs> oh, God. Jesus Christ. These are cops. Get an ambulance in here. I think I need to call the coroner instead. Disappear. He, he tried to kill me. Who, who tried to kill you? The bad man. Fuck, Gordon, I Don't warned you. Is too far, Bruce. I'm not taking this too far. You assume the persona of a bat, but you're not an animal. You beat that man half to death. No, I didn't! Your parents didn't raise you this way. I barely touched him. I applied a little pressure on his arm. I didn't even punch the dude. He's still alive, isn't he? And in the hospital. <sighs> Next time, it might be the morgue. Especially now, during this preposterous attack on your family. You must show the world the true nature of a Wayne. Giving everything to the city and then being murdered for it? My thoughts exactly. Every time you leave this cave, Fair You're enough. a good man, Bruce. Good. Just like your parents. Don't lose that. I don't mean to be a doddering old fool on the subject. Trust me, I won't lose my way. It's quite understandable to stray from the path now and again. So long as you can find your way back. Damn, that, that, that's morbid that he kept the tickets. You never bury the memory. Sometimes I wish I could. It's pretty traumatic, like, at that nine years old. That alleyway. It made me who I am. I can't get it out of my head. That is your gift and your curse. Being Batman can allow you to turn back the tide of treachery that's reached this city's shores. Or drown you in its soil. It's pretty traumatic that he was nine years old when and his parents fate, were killed in front of him. Remember why you started all this. Remember that boy in the alley. I won't forget. Neither will I. Hey. Well, back into the fray again. That place's got to end soon, right? Oh, looks like that egg finally cracked. I want to play some Resident Evil! Inside, Mayor Hill was hiding more than I could have imagined. 
This is a complete manifest of Carmine Falcone's criminal organization. What in the world was Hill doing with all this? Illegal arms dealing, drug running, mob hits, money laundering? Falcone's been involved in everything. You see Dad's name on any of these documents? I'll run a search, but so far I don't. It's blackmail. This is it, Alfred. With this proof, we can finally knock out Falcone's organization. Where would we possibly begin to dismantle it? This is a police matter. There's only one cop we can trust to handle this evidence correctly. Lieutenant Gordon. He could mobilize the entire police force against Falcone. What about that reporter from the Gazette? Vicky. Yes, uh, Miss Vale. She could release this evidence through proper channels. I suppose it comes down to who you want to help most. Or who you think could do the most good. Gordon. No, talk... <laughs> That's not even an... Oh. That's not even a choice. Gordon. The cops are on the front lines of this war. Gordon needs this more than anyone. A wise decision, sir. We'll attack Falcone on two fronts tonight. Gordon through the police, and that man by any means necessary. Whatever Falcone is planning, it ends tonight. He's a spider, Bruce. Eyes everywhere. A dense web of goons poised to trap you. No one has ever managed to bring him down. I haven't tried yet. This is where it ends, isn't it? Or do we still have 30 minutes left or something? It's not like the first episode of nearly every Telltale game is... This... This is a silver bullet. And it's gonna put Falcone down once and for all. I don't even want to know where you got this. No, you don't. Still, I gotta know one thing. Why give this to me? Don't get me wrong. I appreciate the hell out of this. I trust you. I heard you were the last honest man on the force. No need to blow smoke. I got enough cancer coming my way as it is. But thank you. Honestly. Knowing this evidence can lock up Falcone. <laughs> Sleep like a goddamn baby. For once. Isn't it? You know, as much as I appreciate you calling me here, I gotta make one thing crystal. I can't be bought. I'm not trying to you do that. No, this isn't gonna change a thing about the investigation of your family. I didn't. That's... Wayne's always supported the Gotham Police, so I like to believe there's, there's strings no attached. cloaks or daggers hidden in your closet. There are no strings attached. I just want Falcone gone. You and me both. Tired of staring at his mugshot. Isn't it in every Batman like comic and like iteration? C Gordon was go. always one of the cops or detectives been home yet. that was with Bruce Wayne on that night. His parents were murdered. Because I think this whole city's a crime scene. We're just walking through it. <laughs> and what you're holding. I thought Bruce Wayne disappeared. Much safer. I thought he put a Batman on him. Thanks, Bruce. Well, Lieutenant? Hey, stick to Jim. It's done. Good. So is our hunt. The drones located Falcone downtown, a place called the Skyline Club. Although you're not dressed for that kind of party. I know. Well, I can always change in the car. No, doesn't it transform into the, uh... Hell yeah! The ep... ep... 
Oh, half the building was missing. You gotta admit, the textures were pretty good. For a game that came Those out. Cameras and scanning tech are fully functional. What? Alright. Six years ago? Let's six, seven years ago? Good point of entry. <laughs> What's the difference between the Mafia and City Council? I don't know. Aren't they the same thing? Only one of them is organized. Ooh. <laughs> You're cute. So, uh, are you alone? Not anymore, I'm not. Call him the Rizzler. We found the Riddler. You make your round? Yeah. No broken bones. Still yelling from the last time, I bet. Yo, that Victor, is that, is that Jason Statham in the background? I'm Jason Statham. Oh, I can't do his voice. That's the most heavily guarded door in the building. Gotta be Falcone's hideout. Well, it won't be as easy as ringing the doorbell. Four armed guards. Stealth not an option. I'll put together a plan of attack. Stand by. Uh, what do I have to do? since we're taking this guy down. Oh no. Yeah, no, 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 we yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Throw him to the fucking pillar. Yeah, this is sick. I forgot how cool this was. You gotta like plan your plan your takedowns really only one way take him out yeah Things we could do to him. Um, nah, what, what, what's the problem? No, we gotta bash his head onto the table. Give him brain damage for all I care. There's one more guy that I need to scan. Yeah, this dude. This one might be tricky. Any ideas? I've got it covered out. Nah, hang in light, hang in light. Let's drop a light on his head. I mean, Bruce, he doesn't kill anyone. Have you formulated your plan of attack? Going in. Going in. Very good, sir. Your turn to crash his party. <laughs> nice one. Nice one, Alfred. <laughs> that wasn't the plan. 
that was. That was also my plan. Here we go. Oh, that's a triangle. What the fuck? Oh, kick him in the nuts. In the nuts. In the nuts. In the nuts. Oh, shit. Put up a bloody. There you go. Oh, yo, who's the blob? Okay. Gave me a way in. Uh, yes. He wasn't thinking about that. Okay. I shouldn't be working because of the MP, but okay. Explosives armed. Fire when ready. Oh hell yeah. I wouldn't do that if I were you, man. You've lost, Falcon. I can go a few more rounds. All right, all right. The killers. Where are they? What? I found your calling card at the docks. The White Rose. You think I wanted to lead you here? Yeah, something reeks about this whole thing. And it ain't a dead bath. Still wanna play games? We're all being played here, couldn't you? Those chemicals get so riled up about. They're mine, alright? Someone is trying to cut me out of the deal because I did not make that mess at the docks. Then who did? No, oh, we're done. Gotham's watching now. Go ahead. Give him a show. I'll be walking free by tomorrow morning. No, arrest him. <laughs> Well, the Waynes are the biggest gangsters in Gotham. 
Uh oh. And Alfred knew that bitch. Thanks for the assist. Now we only have to take one of you down. Open fire! Good luck, I'm bulletproof. Jack Ryder. Mm. Oh, with Vicky. With Vale. For a clash between the notorious Batman and alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone, who was found dangling over a 50 story drop. Bet Falcone loved that view. Though I'd say the crime boss getting his is well overdue, Falcone has slipped through the law's grasp for years. But after this dramatic arrest and evidence released by the GCPD's Lieutenant Gordon, Falcone's going away for a long, long time. And speaking of newly uncovered criminal dealings, this brings me to the story everyone is talking about. The Wayne family. For generations, the big W on the Wayne Enterprises Tower was a reassuring sight. You knew that there was something pure at the heart of Gotham. That this city, for all its faults, was built by good people. But with Thomas and Martha's shining reputation called into question, we no longer have such assurances. And even worse, it seems the apple hasn't fallen far from the tree. Gotham's greatest son, Bruce Wayne, seen here shaking hands with Carmine Falcone, may be just as crooked as his parents. In his defense, Wayne fired back saying, Whoever fabricated these lies about my family, they will get what they deserve. Understood. In a world where the Waynes, our golden family, are corrupt, are we left with? Who can Gothamites look up to? The Batman. Hero Batman. Batman. Only time will tell. Meanwhile, we'll keep digging for the truth. But the prominent feeling throughout Gotham is that the Wayne's time in the sun is ending. It's gonna go off at Alfred like you knew. Entire cave. Master Bruce? Everything I built. I created all of this because I didn't want any more innocent people to die. If Falcone's telling the truth about my parents, then what the hell did we do this for? Bruce, I. What have you been hiding from me? Alfred! Alfred, you little bitch. Alfred, no. What an absolute giga chat, though. Like, imagine, like, right, being the guardian of your, of, like, your master's son and lying straight to his face. Yeah, look. I, I, I stick with the people. Yeah. Why would you give it to Vicky Vale? What's she gonna do? Yeah, but why would you attempt to kill Falcone? That's not how Batman operates. Ah, mm, mm. Let's, see, let's give a little preview for tomorrow night. When your parents died, they left me as caretaker of their estate, their son, and their secrets. I would never betray them. Your parents were good people, Bruce. No matter what that thug Falcone told you. Then swear to me, there's no truth to it. The evidence you brought me on Falcone held up. Maybe I misjudged you. Now Batman's beating up mobsters too. Who is after next? Hell of a view. Bruce, the Wayne name is toxic. I have to do what's best for my campaign. What's best for Gotham. I have to distance myself. 
I told him that I already. Along with anyone who stands in my way. Oh. No, no, no. That's tomorrow night, my friends. That is tomorrow night. 